And in this context of persecution, I'd like to get an unpopular opinion off my chest because it wouldn't be my sermon if I don't say something unpopular, right? So in this context, here is an unpopular opinion on open doors. You probably must have heard of open doors, an organization that cares for persecuted Christians. Well, it sounds like a noble cause, right? Without question. You may have seen this persecution index, world persecution index, where you can actually read on a map where Christians are most persecuted. It's quite interesting, actually. But let me just tell you something, right? Open Doors is a disgrace. Open Doors is a complete disgrace. This organization is not fulfilling the Great Commission. It's not. They're not doing what they're supposed to be doing. You see, all these persecuted Christians in other countries, do you know what they need? Most of them need the gospel because they're not Christians. I mean, what if I told you that Coptic Christians are not Christians? They're believing in a false gospel. What if I told you that Catholics are not Christians? What if I told you that Pentecostals are not Christians? They're persecuted, yes, but you know what? If you're in an Islamic country, you know you're going to be persecuted if you're not a Muslim. That, that's got nothing to do with serving Christ or preaching the gospel. And you know what? Most Christians don't do that. If you're not preaching the gospel, if you're not living a righteous life, uh, then you can't say that you're persecuted for Christ's sake. Do you know what these people, these Christians need? They need the gospel. But Open Doors doesn't do that. They don't preach the gospel to them. It's a disgrace. They should be concerned about getting people to heaven, that they get saved. Humanitarian aid sounds well and good, but please don't claim that they are persecuted Christians. Unfortunately, most of them are not Christians. It's bad they're persecuted, but here's the thing. The best would be to get him saved and, and show him that it's an honor to be persecuted. Wouldn't that maybe be a better strategy 